Final Boss. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Mr. JT Decker, and this is some more Amnesia Machine for Pigs. <sighs> I've got my lantern. All right, so we just came through the creepy, uh, creepy door passage thing where we were. S uh. Okay, shaky house. Sure. Ah, through the door. In Lily's honor, a banquet. Four glassy orbs fixed upon a point in heaven. Wipe down your trousers, man. There is blood and sweat, and it is most unseemly. Strange. Well, this I don't like. Long, creepy hallways. Okay. Uh, strange. Why would it tell me how to shift? What was that for? What was that sound? Hello? Who's in my house? Who's in my house? Oh gosh, I don't... Okay, that's a, that's a strange picture. Why would you have this hung up in your house? This way, Papa. Come and see. All these kids. What? Whoa! Hey now! Hey now! Let's all calm down. Okay, let's just calm down. Oh god. Alright, it's locked. Kids? I told you not to- Who keeps spilling the wine? Oh, you crazy people. Why would you do this? A oh, recorder thing, eh? I must say, my dear man, you, you look awful. Yes, sir. I seem to have picked up something rather nasty in Mexico. Oh, I know. I don't understand what you've been through. A lesser man would have crumbled. Yet you have made all of this. Your great factory, your charities. It is a wonder for one man alone. It will all be made clear, Professor. But first, a drink. Huh. What is my character's deal? Oh boy. Th these, both of these always look awesome. Which one? This one, I guess. I hear something down the hall. Hello? Oh, love, look at outside! Hey! Oh, oh, it's beautiful. Kids! Whoa. Crap. Kids? It's very dark outside. You should not be playing. I don't think my kids are alive. Let's be honest. I think my kids are dead. This guy's kids are not actually alive. Are they? Oh, hello. Can I use any of these guns? Why can't I use any of the guns? Hmm. An anteater? An aardvark? A hippo? Very dangerous. The hippo. It's a very... It's a killer. A bear. Hello, bear. Can I... Oh, I can move it? I can! The grizzly bear. Ooh. A spider... That is hilarious. That is one of the spiders from Penumbra, which is uh, one of Frictional's first games. Nice little Easter egg there for you. Well, this looks nice. The what the frickin' hell? A crank? Anything else? Any? Um... Crank it! Oh wow, that's very noisy machinery. 
I hope that didn't attract any unwanted attention. I really, really hope it didn't actually. I've never been more serious about anything in my life. Hello? Oh, this game's use of sound makes me want to kill myself. Hello? <laughs> the F? That was very rude. So slam doors in my face. Who the heck's over there? Goodness. Hmm, that is quite unsettling. What? Am I the am I a pig? Am I a pig man? Did I experiment on myself? Hello? Now the cello is playing itself. And the piano is playing itself backwards? That... Oh boy. Haunted... Haunted instruments. Oh god. Lord. Okay, well, clearly... Let's just run around, shall we? We never went down this way. A telephone? Hello? Mandus, do you know me? No. Who are you? Where are my children? Yeah. Trapped, Mandus. Far below us. The machine is fouled. It is breached. It is flooded. The bulkheads are down. The children are engaged. If you help me, I can help you release them. Restore the power, Mandus. Drain the flooding and restart the great engines. Ah. Where should I go? Hello? Hello? Hmm. Okay, well, I... Restarted the power, I think, or something. Do I have any? My journal. I haven't read. It. I need to. <laughs> oh, man, I've not been. Uh, where once we sat to weep Lily's passing under weapons that cannot slay the angels to retrieve her from heaven. Look beyond the painting, Zoswald. Well, once you watched her bathe, the children must have discovered those secret places and taken refuge there. That's creepy. You watched her bathe. That's weird. Grant Hall, that voice on the telephone, he speaks as if he knows me, and indeed I seem to remember him, like a twin pulled away from the other at birth. I feel we are entwined, though I cannot conceive of how. I am a drowning man grasping for the surface within my own house beneath me. I know there are splendid architectures hidden in the dark. If only I could find the entrances. On bears and bathtubs. And after the party, she took my arm and said, But darling... However did you get from the trophy room to the guest bathroom so quickly? Everyone considers you quite the magician. My darling Lilith, Libelith, my father's house has many rooms. And as for mine, well, it also has secret chambers. Oh, you, you, rapscallion. All right, back outside. And can't go anywhere. All right, so that's a useless door. Not a problem. And this leads back to the dining room. Well, okay, so it's a big circle. It's a big old circle thing. All right. Now we... we I, don't, I don't like these sounds. Well, I, I mean, I do like them. They're fantastic, but they creep me out. Oh, we never went here. That is locked. Hello? Hello, bathroom. Hello, hello, tub. Hello, pitcher. Hello, toilet. Hello. Oh. 
Oh, Oliver. Oh, that sneaky toilet. I mean, bathtub. Sneaky bathtub. Oh my god. What the heck? Someone got bludgeoned with a hammer back here. Goodness gracious. A pig mask! And a ki What the heck is in that bed? Look at that. There's a caged bed with something in it. The F. And a very, very bloody room. Oh, goodness. Oh, gracious. Crank it! I can put something in here. What could I... Ew. What the heck is that? Rats. Uh, oh, I could put something on that conveyor belt. What to put in there? Ugh, oh, I can't get... I don't know. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. The... Oh, please. Oh, you can't do this to me, man. Game, game, game. Come on, game. It's no longer in the bed. Whatever was laying in that bed is no longer there. You stupid game. You stupid piece of game. Oh, God. Oh, the door's open. <sighs> what the heck? What the F is that? Even blood everywhere. Oh my gosh. December 20th, 1899. I am to have a visitor, the disguised professor, the distinguished professor A. He is to come to ascertain my mental well-being after my prolonged absence from the club. But I am not stupid. He is here to spy for them. When they stalked the Ripper, he was often called to pontificate upon lacerations and missing organs. And now he has come to me to doff and wheedle my and my dear sir and but you must still grieve and perhaps just a quick look at your engines in the triumph the triumph of the age he knows nothing of loss nothing of sacrifice but to refuse that would simply poke the honest the hornet's nest and invite a swarm of interlopers and thieves I must entertain this buffoon and submit to his intrusion. Perhaps I should show him the tri uh, trippery. See whether his stomach, so trained by rummaging in the innards of clumsy, viv vivisected whores, is strong enough to stare into the real engines of his, of his golden age. I may even introduce him to Jack. Or his sons, at least. We have stronger locks in the windows now, and we bring their toys to them. All right, so it was one of those crazy pig things, Jack, maybe? I assume they're pig things. Hands are bleeding, raw. I scrub and scrub, but the smell will not lift. How can I hold my children with these hands now? How can I kiss them goodnight with lips that have issued such instruction? I don't know. I don't know, dude. Oh, look, another note. Oh, Sally, da 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 Da, 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 da. It's a poem. Look, look. I don't got time for poems. This is this is serious business right here. All right. So some creepy ass bed with some strange pig thing or some creature of some description, which just ran careening down the hallway into the house. Fantastic. Lovely. Let's just. just Party time in this place. Oh my gosh. Alright. Well, I actually have to end this episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed it, make sure to hit like and of course subscribe if you would like to see more. My name is Mr. JT Decker and I will see you guys next time here in Amnesia. Machine for Pigs. Bye-bye.